Did you know you can remove all of your inquiries in 24 hours for free? Well, after this video, you're gonna know how to remove all of your inquiries in 24 hours for free. <laughs> Guys, stay tuned. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you're new to the channel, I'm Credit Coach Q, and I create the first cloud-based software that allows you to put your credit repair expense to your own hands. If you're new to the channel, I'm super, super excited because I have a banger. Today's video, we're going to talk about removing all of your inquiries for free. But before we get into the video, guys, feel like and subscribe to the channel. It allows YouTube to push this video to a wider audience and also allows YouTube to push this to within their algorithm a little more and allows us to leave the lights on. Guys, feel like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you. If you have anything derogatory in your credit report, I mean, anything negative, charge-offs, late payments, bankruptcies, medical bills, guys, you name it, please go over to mycreditapproved.com. It's the website and the software that I was telling the, telling you about that allows you to put the full experience to your own hands. Guys, people are removing thousands of dollars worth of debt by themselves. They are no longer using credit repair companies. They are putting this information and this experience into their own hands and appreciating on a deeper level. Guys, please go to mycreditapproved.com, check out the software, and start removing these items, guys. If you have anything derogatory on your credit report. Now, let Let's dive straight into the meat and potatoes of this video, guys. This video is going to have a lot of sauce because I understand the burden of inquiries. Now, if you do not know, an uh, inquiry can bring your score down between two to three points and it holds 10% of what makes up your credit score. Now, not only that, an uh, inquiry can bring down your score, but also make you almost impossible for to get approved for any type of credit cards or any type of loans. Most creditors will deny you if you have have over four to five inquiries regardless of your score so if your score your income everything is perfect and you have too many inquiries you are going to get automatically denied by the algorithm just because you that how that's how much risk that your your profile is taking on when it comes to those inquiries so let's get those inquiries removed so you won't have to worry about it guys you don't have to hire a credit repair company you don't have to hire your friend your cousin friend pookie to, to remove them you can do this yourself and in my honest opinion i think that this strategy and this method is going to be the best and the strongest for you guys to actually remove it doing it yourself and actually you approaching it with your own story they really can't deny it they really can't have no other choice but to remove it but hiring credit repair companies it really put the company in you in a position where they don't have as much leverage as you because they're not you if you are saying that i don't authorize this if you are saying that this is not mine they really don't have any leg to stand on especially if they can't verify it so let's dive straight in i'm going to give you guys the sauce and this is going to be a no fluff no bluff video so let's dive straight in so the first thing that you want to understand is you have to go find your credit report you have to go get your credit report you can get it from for free on annualcreditreport.com or if you want to see all of your credit reports side by side go to iccredit.com iccredit.com is going to give you the best visual of your credit report for you can see all of the inquiries in real time so now, what you're going to do is you want to basically distinguish which inquiries you want to dispute you you're not going to dispute all of the inquiries obviously because if you have any account open and you dispute it you are at risk for jeopardizing a relationship with that account so if you have a 17 year old capital one and you dispute every capital one inquiry that you see and they find out they're going to close the account your score is going to go down and you're going to lose a 17 relationship with capital one so you want to make sure that you are disputing the ones that you want to dispute and you want to separate separate them and IC credit is going to give you the best visual to do that now once you actually separate the inquiries that you want to work on that you don't want to work on now it's time to dispute so what I want you to do is put on your happy face so, put your happy face on because you're going to need it because you're going to make some phone calls and this is why I said this is the most powerful uh, strategy because this is coming from the horse's mouth so on the screen I'm going to leave uh, the numbers for three bureaus that you're going to call obviously TransUnion, Equifax and Experian and those numbers are going to be the best option for you to get a hold to the fraud department. Now, once you get to the fraud department, you want to talk to a representative. I always ask to speak to the manager. I always ask to speak to the manager. But if you want to talk to a representative, you can do that. But I always ask to speak to the manager. If they ask you why, just say this is a personal matter. And I just rather speak to a manager to get it taken care of. Once you do that, they're automatically going to take your file seriously. If they convince you 
you to stay on the line, stay on the line, but they still going to have the emergency behind your file, okay? Now, the reason I say keep your happy face on is because this is going, your personality is going to determine how easily and smoothly this happens. Now, I told you this is a 24 hour window. This is a 24 hour hack. So in order for the 24 hour hack to work, you gotta put enough fire with a mixture of pleasantry when it comes to the conversation. I hope I said that word, pleasantry, when it comes to the conversation. So you want to basically be welcoming. You want to basically show your charisma and be pleasant. You know, act, show the emergency of actually getting the, the account handle and basically telling them what your expectations are going for it when it comes to your profile and tell them that these inquiries is bringing your score, your profile and hindering you from you actually getting approvals that you actually deserve. And once you say that, because the, the three bureaus just went under fire for not appropriating the emergency of repossessions, they had a repossession debacle uh, a couple of months back with the CFPB did an investigation and they got in trouble and actually have to pay out because they didn't basically remove repossessions that was jeopardizing people accounts and profiles. Now, if you say that they're going to know that they are going to have to put some emergency behind your profile and what you're going to say is this, this is the script. You're going to say that I want you guys to verify really quickly that these accounts and list off the accounts that you have under your dispute tab and basically tell them to verify. So say, do, do you guys have, I don't know where these accounts are from and I want you guys to verify to make sure that the placement on my credit report is accurate. Say that. And once you say that, if they do not have the verification in front of them, then say, well, if you guys cannot verify the inquiries, I'm going to ask you guys to remove it so I can go on and get the credit that I deserve. Guys, you say that with each individual credit bureau, including TransUnion, because TransUnion is always going to be the bitchy uh, sister. They always going to give you the hardest time to get the items removed. But if you say what I just said, and if you have to pause it and rewind it basically to get the script down pat, but you, if you say what I just said, it's going to be everything that you need. It's going to be all the legal jargon. It's going to be all of the uh, proper etiquette. Everything that you need is in that script. Rewind the tape or whatever you need to do to make sure that you are saying it properly. Practice and say it with the most pleasant tone that you can have and because that is going to be the deciding factor on your removal. Guys, this hack has been working like hotcakes. I want everyone that has any inquiries to uh, actually use it before they actually plug it and start retraining their staff to handle these type of situations differently. Guys, let me know in the comment section how you feel about this. Do you feel like this is a winner? And let me know in your experience. If you need any type of credit repair, if you want us to do these inquiries yourself, go over to mycreditapproved.com and we'll sign up for a consultation so we can talk to you about your credit and get it handled. Guys, until next time, take care of your credit. Take care of yourself. Credit Coach Q out.